all the color correction presets as you can see they are all in here the transitions are in here just like the other versions we have all the transitions we have the video effects we have everything that you need in this version is in vegas 15 you don't need to reinstall anything all the plugins you have will all be automatically be in vegas 15 that's a really awesome thing and let's say that we want to render out obviously uh, clips we're going to click on this little icon above the preview screen we're going to click on it and as you can see right now this bent this menu pops up is the same as the previous ones and as you can see we have to put in our new render settings obviously but actually the rendering uh a box that we used to see in other versions but they're actually changed up a little bit so we're gonna go ahead and uh, browse and I'm gonna explain to you guys how this works now as you can see on the left this is the list where you can pick your format let's say that you want to render it out in uh, main concept in QuickTime in Sony but what we're gonna do I'm gonna I'm not gonna show you guys the best render settings in this video because it's just a full walkthrough <laughs> What's happening guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Vegas 4... Wait, wait a minute, Vegas 14? Well guys, welcome back to this video, and in this video I'm gonna, guide, I'm gonna walk you guys through Vegas 15. It released today, August 28th, 2017, and I want to thank Magix for hitting me up with a free copy, you know, to test it out, to make tutorials in, because I'm a huge tutorial channel, and that's why Magix said like, yo, we want you to make tutorials in this, in this program, so here you go, enjoy this free copy. So I got early access to the program, and I also wanted to share my, uh, my feedback with them. But now, as you can see, Vegas 15 is now open and released to the public, so you can purchase it right away, or you can upgrade from 14 to 15. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys exactly what the program is, what's new, what the difference are with between other versions, like what's the difference between 14 and 15. So I would say make sure to smash the like button down below, and I would say let's get started. So as you guys can see, when we open up Vegas 15, we start with a brand new look, because as you guys know, Vegas 14, Vegas 13, Vegas 12, Vegas 11, they have all really light uh, layouts and this is what this one is way darker and this means that it is way I think this is a great improvement because I think this is way way better for let's say you're editing at night because the light is not gonna be that bright so it, it is nice and dark so it's not really that tiring to look at what like let's let's say when you're editing at night so that's a huge improvement and the first awesome thing you can do is you can customize the layout that's really new and I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do that so as you can see right now we are in a a pretty dark Vegas layout so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to options just like the previous versions you want to go and click on preferences and as you can see right now we're gonna go to display and right here we have four options to choose from let's say that you want to use this current theme that is dark you can use that one you can use medium I'm gonna show you guys exactly how it looks so I'm gonna pick medium and I'm going to click on apply and as you can see I need to restart the program so I'll catch you guys when this is restarted okay guys as you can see the program Program is restarting and I think this intro screen looks very awesome that's a huge improvement as well all right guys as you can see this is the medium look it is just a little bit closer to the standard one that's from the previous versions so if we want to go to options we can click on preferences we can go back to display and you can also choose light that's going to be lighter and you can also choose white that's going to be white so, but I'm going to click on dark and I'm going to click on apply because that's my favorite look so let's go back to the dark modus all right folks as you can see we are back in vegas i restarted it and this is basically what i'm going to use as my new editing program and obviously everything works the same just right click insert audio track right click insert video track and you can choose uh like you can customize those colors as well if you right click on it you can go ahead and you can say like display color you can choose a lot of new colors let's say that you want to have yellow as you can see now it is yellow so it's really awesome that you can fully customize vegas to your own wants and needs Needs, and that's freaking amazing now the other things that we have is media generators uh, obviously just like last time and as you can see all the presets and the plugins I used are in this version. You don't need to um, reinstall all the color correction presets. As you can see, they are all in here. The transitions are in here, just like the other versions. We have all the transitions. We have the video effects. We have everything that you need in this version is in Vegas 15. You don't need to reinstall anything. All the plugins you have will all be automatically be in Vegas 15. That's a really awesome thing. And let's say that we want to render out 
obviously uh, clips. We're going to click on this little icon above the preview screen. We're going to click on it. And as you can see right now, this menu pops up. It's the same as the previous ones. And as you can see, we have to put in our new render settings, obviously. But that video will release in two hours, guys. How to the best render setting for YouTube. So make sure to stay tuned for that video because I will show you guys exactly in two hours the best render settings in this program, Vegas 15. So make sure to stay tuned and make sure to check out and keep an eye on your sub box. Now, other things that are new is basically like I said the layout you can fully customize it the look is also a little bit different as you can see with those uh, icons uh, we have a yellow icon this one we have so that means you can play it solo uh, we have other tracks this is the video track this is the audio track it is just so much better and I think Magix did a huge it did an awesome job in actually uh, upgrading and improving uh, Vegas 15. Now if you go ahead and re if you're gonna pick a random image so we can just go ahead and uh, render it. If you go go ahead and do that so I'm going to select this. I'm going to click on file. We're gonna click on render as and as you can see this is actually the rendering box that we used to see in other versions but they're actually changed up a little bit. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, browse and I'm gonna explain to you guys how this works. Now as you can see on the left this is the list where you can pick your format let's say that you want to render it out in uh, main concept in quicktime in sony but what we're gonna do i'm gonna i'm not gonna show you guys the best render settings in this video because it's just a full walkthrough but this is basically uh your rendering process you're gonna pick your format and then on the right you can also pick preset and as you guys can see right here it says 60 fps and i just installed this program so i did not transfer anything and right here as you can see it says 60 fps so that is this is automatically uh, put in Vegas 15 my Vegas 14 settings so I don't need to do every all the settings uh, over and over again it is just really simple pick your format pick your settings right here 60 FPS 1080p give it a name choose a location you can click on render and that is basically how to render out things but, but I'll be going in detail in uh, two hours in the video specifically about rendering in this program because this program is just a few hours old it just released everyone has a lot of questions about it like how do I render this out I do I do how do I do this and how do I do that well it's really straightforward and I think Magix did an awesome job and obviously if you work on a bigger monitor because I'm working on a laptop if you have like a huge monitor or even iMac what you can do obviously just like the previous versions is you can make this preview screen a lot bigger just drag this guy down drag this guy to the left and as you can see the preview screen becomes bigger and that makes it a lot easier to edit in so this is basically the full walkthrough on Vegas 14 a brand new layout all the settings that we have all the preset all the color correction packs are automatically put in this in this program it is really awesome the render settings are there and you can also do anything else and obviously as you can see uh, audio wise the mixer on the right didn't go anywhere so that's really amazing i think that is it for this walkthrough this is basically how to do it anything you did in sony vegas 12 sony vegas 13 vegas pro 14 Everything is possible in this program and let's say if you messed up your layout like let's say that your uh, Preview screen is gone for for one weird reason. So what you can do is go to view Go to Windows layouts and click on default layout and now this the layout is exactly the same as how you installed it So that is basically the full review of Vegas Pro 15 I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll be answering your questions in the comments down below and obviously guys all your previous projects your vegas 14 project you can perfectly open that up with vegas 15 so let's say that you have edited your videos or you have a, a standard video editing template in vegas 14 you can just open that with vegas 15 that is no problem a really awesome thing and that is also possible so make sure to put down your comments like can you do this i'll be answering them in the comments so thank you for watching make sure to grab your copy of Vegas you can find all the info in the description to get to to get your license or you can upgrade from 14 to 15 it is completely up to you so I want to thank you for watching thank you for the continuous support my name is Alec this has been the full review of Vegas 15 so thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in two hours like I said for the best render settings in Vegas 15 you don't need to go ahead and figure it out yourself I'll be showing you guys exactly and you guys can follow along so that's it thank you and I'll see you guys in two hours just Alex Halford